Or how many of you went and told your mother or your father or, your, or, or, or anyone and they made you think it was your fault? You're being fast. You dress a certain way. I know I told and I got the heck beat out of me when I told. It wasn't even up on me. I told what I saw. We're getting real. You got a problem with it? Don't come on this channel. Because the healing has to happen now. The darkness that's about to go forth can inhabit your wounds. Demons inhabit your wounds. Demons inhabit your unhealed areas. Which is why he keep the people who were molested with such shame. And why he keep the ones who molested. Sometimes they got, they still go on and have good lives. And got everything. And they never repent or get help. Because the people doing the molesting got devils too. Don't think that thing gone when you ain't been uh, delivered and you ain't you haven't healed and went and went before that person that dealt with it. Oh, it's still there. He's trying to catch you at the end of your life. It's still there. And I'm telling you, if you molested people and you have never gone to them and you have never confessed your fault to them and asked them for their forgiveness and helped them to heal, you in trouble. Because if you think you're going to leave this place and go to heaven, you in trouble. Somebody then lied and they lying against the truth. I don't care how good a life you had. I don't care what church you go to. I don't care if you go every Sunday and seven days a week.